With the authentication system in place, let's add a way to associate tags with users. To achieve that, we need to define a relationship between the user model and the task model. A user should be able to create many tasks, while a task should belong to a particular user. This is a one-to-many relationship, and as earlier mentioned, we can easily define relationships with Lucid. First, we need to add a new column to the tasks table, which will be user underscore id. We can either create a new migration for that or update the existing tax migration. Since we are in development, we will be going with the second option. Table.integer user underscore id. The column will be unsigned and not nullable. We need to roll back and rerun the migration. Node is migration colon roll back. This will roll back the last migration, which is the user's migration. But we actually want to roll back the migration for the tasks table. Instead of having to run this multiple times, we can set batch to zero, which will roll back the old migration. Then we can rerun the migration. Next, let's define the new column on the tax model as well. Public user ID, which will be number. Now let's define the relationship. To define a as many relationship, we make use of the at as many decorator. At as many. This accepts a closure that returns the related model, which in our case is the task model. Then the name of the relationship will be tasks. Then as many type of tax don't forget to import tax and as many next let's define the inverse of the relationship on the tax model that belongs to the user model then the name of the relationship will be user then belongs to type of user. Again, don't forget to import user and belongs to. So we have defined the relationship between the two models. In the next lesson, we'll see how we can start making use of the relationship.